Each year, high school students from around Wisconsin go head-to-head in a grueling competition. And they also have a lot of fun. It's the Lake Sturgeon Bowl. In February, 23 teams from around Wisconsin gather to determine one thing. Who knows the most about ocean sciences? Chemistry, biology, physical ocean sciences, they must know it all. Which of these oceanic currents is a western boundary? Which dinoflagellate genus? What animal once ranged from Japan to California? Is correct. Carbonic acid compensation depth. Why? Carbonite dissolution depth. It's hard work, but they do it for the fun of it. I felt like I was playing Jeopardy. I was like, yes, I know this answer. <laughs> it's really a fun time. I like the competition. It's friendly. It's fun. Yeah. It's just, it's a good time. Yeah. I didn't know there's so much information on the oceans. I love um, science and I want to learn more about the environment. And it's just really fun to come to the competitions and just see how everyone does. I like being around water myself. And I guess I might as well learn more about it since I like it so much. The Ocean Bowl allows you to include many other sciences like chemistry, physics, and that's what I'm interested in. I've learned I need to learn more currents. It's more Current. about ocean currents and tectonic plates. Yeah. One team will emerge victorious. That team will go on to compete in the even tougher National Ocean Sciences Bowl, involving students from nearly all the coastal and several Great Lakes states. The top three national winners earn a hands-on field trip to a marine research site in places like Hawaii, Bermuda, and Costa Rica. From 2009 through 2012, the National Ocean Bowl Championship has been won by a team from Wisconsin. We're a long ways from the ocean, but we know our ocean sciences. It's a great way for, for students to get excited about science. Get some interested in science and interested in ap academics, so I think it's a fantastic opportunity for any school or any kid to get into. They are really up on their physics and their oceanography, so it's a great, it's a great experience to be sitting at the table and watching this competition. We now have one person in geological engineering at Madison, we have another person doing a geology major at the University of Canada, and another person has a fisheries management from Stevens Point. Our kids end up going into marine biology, engineering, marine engineering, freshwater resources. I mean, we graduate 50 kids a year, but every year 10, 15 of them go into STEM careers where I think this plays a role in inspiring them to do that. The Wisconsin Sea Grant Institute has supported the Sturgeon Bowl for more than 10 years with funding, study materials, and coaching of teachers and students. We're proud to be working with students and teachers in traditionally underserved areas.